Welcome back to Mario Kart Wii. In this part, we are in the beginning the special cup. <laughs> in this part, Wii! Oh. That guy. <laughs> That's what I should have said as we fell down. Man, what if Mario Kart had battle sequences? <laughs> it does battle Mario mode. Isn't the whole thing a battle sequence? Uh. Whoa. All right, Carrie. It's no, like when you're playing. Okay. It's like if you say something is smarter than than I could say. Then I, you gotta okay. go. sorry. I can no, say no, something no. dumb. It, it, it's like when you're playing SRB2 Kart online, and then that one dipshit picks the battle stage, and it just, and that's the one guy whose stage it lands on, and you're like, God damn it! Now we're in battle mode for at least nope, that, three rounds. <laughs> that's literally that's I've played. I think I've played a solid like. 1,000 races online in Mario Kart. How much battle have you played in Mario Kart? I have played one. Nice. Um, was it Shine Runners or Bomb on Blast? No, it was uh, Cops and Robbers, actually. Oh, that's, it's called. oh that's interesting. I'm not, I'm not a fan of that one. I didn't know really? I think that was kind of fun. I think it was fun if people are puppy guarding the fucking jail cells, dude. That's true. That's true. Cucking assholes. I forgot, I forgot the phrase puppy guarding. Yeah, I, I kind of forgot Thank about you. that, too. Same. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, it's like it's like it's like playing, it, it, it's like playing Smash Bros with a couple of ten-year-olds, and then it's like you know it's like a four-way match, and then like two people go after Did the that same flower guy. Just kill them and with then, allergies. Yes, and then it the was guy shooting pollen at them. It's like it, it's like playing Smash Bros with a couple of ten-year-olds, and like two people attack the same guy, and he yells, "No teaming!" <laughs> If I ever have to battle Will, I'm gonna use the flower and destroy him with allergies. I was gonna say, Carrie, if you if you don't have allergies, you don't understand. You can die from. <laughs> it was good. <gonna, laughs> I was gonna make that point. We were already talking about the next topics. So I was like, I thought I just wanted. To I was this. thinking seasonal allergies, though. No, um, just... which oh, can dude. probably kill you if they're bad enough, but that's really rare. I um. Hey, who do you think would win in a fight? Seasonal allergies or seasonal depression? Oh. oh, probably the latter. Damn, okay. dude, you know sucks is having seasonal depression and seasonal allergies because they're like not oh, at the same time. Those are so cute. I know I already said that, but I love them. Sorry, Will. <laughs> so it's just like you're either depressed or you're sneezing. Those are the <clears throat> two options. Those are the other two options. Have fun. <laughs> yeah, it's not options. Yeah, you you have both. <laughs> yeah. You're like, depressed you really and you're sneezing. Different. Gosh. I feel like you gotta feel different. Allergies. You got both. Wait, does winning mean they're more dangerous, or winning mean they're less dangerous? No, they're just fighting each other. So. Okay. Um. Yeah. I think seasonal depression would win. Seasonal depression punches seasonal allergies in the face, and then uh, seasonal allergies returns with a groin shot. <laughs> wow. Where's the balls? I uh, I was at a, I was at a store. Kind of like a more natural grocery store. Wow, well, me what? too. Is it called Natural Grocers? It was not called Natural Grocers. Um, Wait, did you say problem. National Grocers? <laughs> natural. natural. natural grocers. The only grocery store in America. <laughs> There's only one. There's only one. You have to drive all the way to Nebraska to get there. Of nowhere in Nevada. <laughs> the anyway. line's just like eight hours long. He just everybody just eats like fucking rice and bologna because it's the only thing that'll last nine months. A literal <laughs> bread line. <laughs> um. No, and I found a, in like, I, don't, I guess it was the help, like, aisle, I guess, like the, I don't know, they had some alternative medicine. And there was just like a tube of pollen. Oh, bee just, pollen. Yeah, I was like, whoa, the I better tube. put this away. I don't want to touch this. <laughs> yeah, I've heard of people eating that. Really? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah bee, this heart, bee discharge, or bee pollen is just like shit, though. Just, yeah, bee it's pollen. Like, why do people eat that? I wouldn't know. Let me Why do people uh, eat honey? I will say though, it does uh, stay in cars pretty well. So yeah, honey is sweet. Some of it, uh, you don't smoke it. Um, smoke you it? You got the artifact. No. You eat it. But what if you did smoke it? What if you I smoked it? it? Would I die? It'd be like allergies <laughs> plus. You would, you would die, but it would be the best goddamn death you'd ever experience. <laughs> <laughs> I do well, not advocate. Uh, uh, I guess I should put a disclaimer here. I do not advocate for overdosing on pollen or anything for that matter. <laughs> Please don't OD, but you can be OD yourself. So um, I put—I know I posted this in the Discord chat earlier, but I was at church 
today. And our reading was, well, part of our reading was, every valley shall be exalted and every mountain and hill shall be made low and the crooked shall be made straight and the rough places made smooth. And all I heard was, all brains will become smooth. <laughs> <laughs> the prophecy of the Lord. The prophecy, <laughs> prophecy is true. Smooth brain. <laughs> Is Gabe the prophet? Yeah. Gabe the prophet? I bring upon the smoothest brains to my No, Gabe's an angel, because there's Gabriel the angel. He's the <gasps> messenger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He came down and was like, Yo! And then left. <laughs> Pretty sure that's how I win the Bible. <laughs> Yo, Mary. That was it, Gabe. You did it. You about to have God's son. Yeah. I messaged Dog. Evan when I was, uh... <laughs> I can't pull it up right now, but uh, if I remember, I'll try to pull it up afterwards. When What's I up? Messaged Evan. Oh, when I messaged you while I was waiting for my computer to turn back on. Oh, I got the texts. I read them to these two. Okay. Good. Yes. <laughs> Wee! They're a little too heavy, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> no, you felt like yeah. you like three or four flaps. How far can you go? It took me a second yeah. to realize that I could have flipped that into uh, that <laughs> joke. <laughs> when you realize mid joke that your joke is going to flop, but you have to commit. Yes. Yeah. Actually, I had a. <laughs> in high school, I was in a. I was in like a. We had a guitar class. Right? You like were in a lot group. in high school. <laughs> I know. Um, but in our in my guitar group, there was a guy who was just. His whole fucking life was dedicated to just, like, things being funny. Like, he didn't want to be a comic, but he just wanted the quality of jokes in general to be very high. Okay. So if you told a joke that wasn't funny, he'd be like, that wasn't funny. Don't say that again. <laughs> <laughs> but because at first I thought he was just a huge dick, but then, then he started telling a joke and then realized it wasn't funny and just went, that wouldn't be funny. Never mind. It just stopped talking. He <laughs> <laughs> just... It, it's not so. It's not that he was a dick. It's just that his standards were really high. <laughs> just, yes, <laughs> just super high. It's like when you're trying to do a time trial in Mario Kart and you keep on fucking up, just like just getting like pressing A right after two. Like, do you want oh, it to be yes. like frame perfect? Yes. You keep on fucking it up, so you just like play the, you play it, you restart it like seventeen times. So and you can, it, yeah, and get you the just right keep start. On fucking it up, <laughs> and then you like fuck it up like right after you get it right. So you probably just, it's a waste of time. But one of my like actually that kind of brings me to one of my favorite editions of um the uh like in when you do time attack mode in um Sonic Mania uh they have it set so that if you hold the X button down uh it'll just restart instantly so you don't have to go through a menu and wait for it to like load again. Wow. That's a pretty good RTA. It's just you know, it's like cuz like they know if you're doing that kind of mode, you're probably going to fuck up. And then as a result, you know, you need to, like, they don't want you to go through the uh, pain of starting over again and again and again with, uh, or at least, like, the tedium of waiting for it to start up again. Because, mm -hmm. you know, it's like, once you got to, like, the 12th time it's happened, you really, you, you really don't want to see that loading screen again. Mm -mm. These, uh, these chain chomps look like they're ill. Put them down. Okay. They're stones. stone. I messed with Gabe's head. They're stone. Yeah. Hmm. No, they don't have lungs. No, they do. Does so getting you can... stone oh. remove your lungs? Yes. Oh. No, I mean, they can't. Wait, hang on. Okay. I need clarification. Will, how can we breathe right now, dude? Am I stoned? <laughs> Is he? <laughs> well, well you've been I'm a little gay, before. so... <laughs> it can happen. What? <laughs> the real, the real question is, um, how much Gatorade did you drink afterward? How much Gatorade do you have to drink to become gay? Oh man! Oh no! <laughs> That's one of those jokes that like takes a second to completely process. <laughs> Wait, I didn't get it. Fuck. Don't explain it to me though, because it'll make it not funny. Okay. I'll just live in darkness for the sake of comedy. <laughs> well, well, you think about that. Um, I have a question about the uh, marijuana. So, 
Are you only stoned if you smoke it, or what? No. What if you consume it in other ways? Is that still stoned? Stone is just another word for high. No, it's okay. marijuana, so uh, you need to get married for it to work. Married to? I was, I was just about to make that. You need to get married in Tijuana. <laughs> oh yeah, Gabe, you're gonna voice this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Is that a fair change hat? Change hat. That's pretty cool. What? He's taking form. He is, he is, a, he is Oh, he's gonna become a pharaoh. He's a bird. Yeah. You ignored all these very scary warnings. Don't you have the common sense to get scared and run away? What's wrong with you? He's trying to play himself off as if as like this like ancient pharaoh, but he's actually just a Bowser goon. How much Gatorade do you need to drink before you become an alligator? I don't know. This is Tutan Koopa. He's one of Bowser's followers, and he's been assigned to the guard here. I heard that he has sort of a pharaoh complex. <laughs> you think? He doesn't have the beard much, thing, though. He attacks by throwing shells in that I perch. Try to dodge when he uses magic. Its attack power is two, and it'll sting for sure. And he also summons chomps, his loyal subjects. These chomps have some serious attack power. Think hard about who to attack first, Tutankupa Koopa or the chomp. Okay, to follow up on what you said about okay. Gatorade, okay. how much dick do you have to suck before you become a crocodile? <laughs> Crocodile? <laughs> exactly two. <laughs> oh hey, the cathedral I attend is on the front page of our local news. Oh, it's just a picture because it looks nice on the inside. Ah. Well, does it look nice on the inside? Huh? Does it look nice on the inside? It looks nice on the inside. That's good. He's but a champ. Matter. You've heard Wait, about I'm champs, confused. I'm sure. Does it look nice on the inside? Yeah, I look good. You look good on the inside. I I don't know. I've, I've never I've never uh, performed surgery. I almost like, committed surgery on myself. Committed surgery. <laughs> Time to commit surgery. <laughs> That's it. Where's my scalpel? I'm gonna commit surgery. Yeah, watch this. Bam! Yeah, Fucked him up. Oh shit. Okay, no, that surgery. hurt. <laughs> Is that like the like when <laughs> if you're like in doctors without borders and you're like. Trying to save a patient and he dies like out in the middle of a jungle or something. And you're like, <laughs> you have to honorably commit surgery on yourself. To... <laughs> it's like there it's he like... needed his leg removed. Oh my gosh! So kind of what I have to do. Is it like Japanese ritual suicide? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sudoku. Sudoku. Yes. I'm going to That's what it's called. Sudoku. Fuck two threes next to each other. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's he doing? Ooh, he's got, he's ooh, got a he's big got boy. A, he's got a magic, he's got a magic lad there. Magic lad. <laughs> magic lad. He's magic lad. Oh yeah, since the partner doesn't have a health bar in this game, uh, if they just get injured, they can't attract for a couple turns. Ah. Uh, Look could you fucking asshole. Starting with the sequel, that partner will get, like, will get, uh, HP of their own. Um, so they can tank a hit for Mario in that case. And since you got multiple of them, you know, you can just keep doing that again and again and again and work. Because you only lose the game if Mario dies. Okay. So you can basically be a tank and health fodder, right? Yeah. But also, uh, you can use their abilities to useful effect like a decent person would. Oh, he's using that attack again. Oh, he got okay. himself! You fucking... <laughs> Idiot. <gasps> Dumbass. Deep idiot. Also, fuck you. <laughs> this dog was crying before it died. Alright. There's a dumbass and a smart ass. Is there like a mediocre ass? A mediocre <laughs> ass? She's a pretty mediocre ass. <laughs> Is he like Zorak from Space Ghost Coast to Coast? He's pretty much no vocal cords. Because that's the, that's the to. That's what I'm getting from that voice, Gabe. He just has to make clicking I, sounds I in the back of honestly throat. only ever remember watching Space Ghost Coast to Coast as a very little kid, whatever it be on. Because all I knew was the cartoon Space Ghost, and I thought it was the same thing. Oh no. Uh, he's the same characters, but 
Uh, I remember my dad laughing at it a lot more than I was, and I just didn't. But that, I mean, that makes sense. That makes sense. Um, what I see, what I remember is um, particularly um, just, I mean, this one scene I love um, is uh, like when Space Ghost's grandpa shows up and just starts belittling him, and I'm pretty sure he was voiced by Macho Man Randy Savage. <laughs> oh, what? Yeah. Dude, Hang on, I let me look him. this up. I love, I love hearing him in Bolt every time. He's, he's so good at me. Ooh, you can't see what you can't hit. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Wait. Um. Hang on a second. I'll watch the clip back. You know how much I love me, Mr. Episode. He was also in an episode of Duck Dodgers as a drill sergeant. You were very huh. good in it too. Yeah. 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 It was. It was. It was. It was Mr. Macho Madness himself. Yeah. The so cream will rise to the top. It is the six. I gotta pop open a fucking chocolate from Evan. Well, that's big. So that chain chomp that's on top of uh, Tootin Koopa's hat, hat um, does it sometimes steal his food when he's trying to eat? That'd be pretty annoying. Trying to take a bite of his burrito, but the chain chomp on his hat swoops down and eats the burrito. It like extends at, from yeah. like. <laughs> it, I'm not gonna take my hat off. I'm like, Fuck. <laughs> But That's he wants to continue looking like a pharaoh, is the thing. Hats off at meals. Hats off at meals. So they're chain chomps, don't I mean, I, I think I think I see what they're going for, because, like, doesn't, like, doesn't, like, the, uh, the stereotypical pharaoh hat have, like, uh, a dog's head on it? Uh, you know, uh, it, has, sure. it has, you know, like, Anubis a dog, or it has... Well, yeah, yeah, like, know, it's, I think it's supposed to be Anubis, or... and Anubis is, yeah. like, a dog god. Yeah. And so, like, and chain chomps are dogs, so that's definitely what they were going for with this. And I know, like, some Look, pharaohs, snakes. you know, affiliated closer with some gods, one another is like, you know, obviously, mm -hmm. uh, the gods of wisdom, mm -hmm. you have Thoth, you have. A lot of them look like they I don't, have I don't really know a lot of Egyptian gods. That's there's all, oh, there's a club penguin one with the puffle on it. What? <laughs> Club Penguin was developed by Egyptians. <laughs> yeah. The ancient Egyptians. I mean, dual monsters. Okay, what, is they're hiding? what if the pyramids are just? Is that Club Penguin? <laughs> yes. Nine one one. How can I help you? What do you mean it's you're being penguin. murdered? That's they're illegal. Right People can't do that. People can't do that. What did you help? He's gone. Goodbye. He's gone. He's dead. He's dead. He died. Goodbye. Farewell. So <laughs> Holy shit! It's detonated. You know, no. You know what I actually do remember about um, Egyptian, like about like when we studied ancient Egypt in school was <laughs> what, uh, how cringe it was. The teacher what? mispronounced Ra as Ray. Oh no. Oh no. Dude, this is so what we're doing. Have you see seen that? That meme where it goes like, this really was on like page three of our textbooks, and it's like a super duper like white dude uh -huh. wearing a barrow hat. <laughs> oh no! Yes! <laughs> Are you looking it up? Yeah. I do. I, I heard I you're know. clicking. I remember getting that. I remember seeing that picture the first time and sending it to my history teacher. <laughs> I was oh like, my please gosh. show this in class. And he just replied, no. <laughs> <laughs> Next time on Smash Team Games, we all become white dudes wearing pharaoh outfits. Finally. <laughs>